Okay, we're starting our our second canoe trip down the Natchez River. We're here at um, a bridge that crosses the Natchez River. I believe this is Anderson's Crossing, right here. Uh, it's a nice little uh, entry spot. You know, it's got a nice little boat ramp right down to it, right here. And we're going to finish in about 10 miles. We're going to finish at Highway 7, and uh, we've got about 10 miles. Miles goes. We're starting at about 2:15. Imagine it's probably going to take us about three to four hours to do this. All right, so we'll see you in a few minutes once we get started. Okay, here we are. We just started on our on our uh, Natchez River trip. It's it's really uh, really gorgeous. The river's not moving too fast. So nice, slow river. Lots of bird activity all around us. You know, up in the trees. Lots of birds calling. We've already seen one turtle splash in. Imagine we're probably going to see quite a few more turtles. We'll try and get some video of the turtles, although that's always tricky because they're uh, they tend to be very wary. So we'll see. All right, well, we'll check back in in a little while. We're gonna enjoy the river now for a while. Okay, we've stopped at about a quarter of our way into our trip. Going a bit slower than we thought we would. see how nice and peaceful it is. The birds are calling. I've seen a couple turtles go in, but didn't get a close look at them, so not sure what they were. We did get a uh, really big fish that came up right next to the boat that gave us a little jump, because it was, it was pretty big. Okay, I'm zooming in on a... Evan, move your head out of the way. Did you see the fish guy? I'm zooming in on a dragonfly sitting on Ryan's leg. Kind of freaked Ryan out there for a second. Ryan went, whoa! And there was a dragonfly sitting on his head. On his, on his leg. We just had a fish. Kind of bobbed to the surface right there. Next to it. Alright, just checking in. You can see that we've got sort of more of the same gorgeous habitat around us. Boys are bickering at each other, splashing at each other. I think they're getting tired. So we've been on the river for been on the river for about two and a half hours. We're about two thirds of the way through. We probably got another hour left to go. The flow in this stretch is really slow. If you compare that to uh, oh our first video on the Natchez River, the flow was quite a bit faster at that northern that uh, section north of here. Quite slow, you can see. We're just kind of this is this is without paddling. You can see we're just kind of creeping along. Very relaxing river. We've seen about we've been passed by. Uh, Four motorboats going in the opposite direction. So a little bit of traffic on the river today, but it's not bad at all. You can see you can get it so that it's totally quiet. Not seeing a lot of wildlife. Only seeing a couple turtles drop in. That actually kind of concerns me a little bit. That hardly seeing any turtles whatsoever. Lots of bird wildlife though. Lots of birds around. So if you're a bird into birds, you'll you'd love this trip. No snakes or anything, which is sort of a disappointment for us. All right, signing off. We're going to get going again. Okay, guys, here we are coming in to our takeout point. We got Highway 7 right up ahead of us. We actually have a uh, little greeting party 
forest. I've got a Ryan pedal right hand side. That was a nice trip. Took us about, that was about a little under four hour trip. Nice shot of the uh, swallows hanging out by the river, swooping in. I guess they're either feeding or some were down low, maybe getting a drink of water.